everyone and welcome again to today's edition of The Dog House on GTV6. I'm Dottie Sharkey. And I'm Caroline Hynes, the Behavior and Training Supervisor at the Pasadena Humane Society. And we are so excited. We have some great pets to show you today and also have a special deal for uh, our senior pets. But uh, first, let's see how we did on our last show. Okay, so first on our show today, we have a bunny, Mr. Fluffy, although we're not sure if it's Mr. or Mrs., so we'll just say Dr. Fluffy. <laughs> Dr. Fluffy, A number 366387, an unaltered adult, oh, female. So I guess maybe it is Mrs. Fluffy, Miss Fluffy. Well, uh, a white lop ear bunny. And what's so funny is just before we had her on, it was that she's very mellow and, and her ears match her mellowness. <laughs> Yeah. Look at this. The lop ear. Dude, look yeah. at how cute Just you are. Next. Oh. <laughs> she was an owner turn in and she oh. does have an injury on her hind leg, but it doesn't affect her quality of life. So um, she's just fine with a little limp. She is a sweetheart. She did. And I understand loves to be held. Mm -hmm. It looks and that way. I can tell. Yes. And so and cuddled. And how could you not want to cuddle? Yes. So cute. And her adoption fee is only thirty dollars. So she's so mellow. Yeah, she's got she's so, so many mellow. whiskers. Like I don't know if you can see it on the camera, like how just how many She's got tons of whiskers. Yes. Look at this. Maybe oh no, you can't see. But anyway, she has kind of big paws. Mm hmm <laughs> She's well, she's a, but she's, she's so, so relaxed. Mellow. Yeah, I've never seen her. look at this. I could just but I know she likes to be held. Is she super soft too? Oh she, <laughs> I'm just gonna stay there. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> she could be a permanent fixture on the show, couldn't she? She could. She could she just could stay be. on the show. <laughs> Let's just keep her on the show for the whole time. Uh, See how you, she is with dogs. And did we mention the little button nose? Did you mention I that? I don't know if you I did. You wanna go poom. <laughs> it's so cute. And the little like crevice in the head is so darn cute too. <laughs> a reverse mohawk, we'll call that, right? You know what? <laughs> you are just so cute. So calm. cute. Well, so calm. we don't want her to stay on the show. We would no, rather have, we have her get adopted. So, so let me give her A number again. Yeah, we don't want her as a permanent. No. We want her adopted. In a home. Yes. 366387 is her A number again. Um, Miss Fluffy or Mr. Fluffy. You can call her just Fluffy too, I guess. Um, and adoption fee is $30 for her. Uh, now from bunnies to cats, um, Pumpkin is our next cat fitting for the season. Um, and All of right. course, you if you didn't guess already, be. it's an orange tabby or a ginger tabby. Kind of gingery. Um, and pumpkin's A number is 366655, uh, neutered 10 year old male. So um, if you haven't heard oh, yet, this happened? month our senior cats are free. So pumpkin would fit for the senior cat. Pumpkin is not behaving like a 10 year old no. by any means. No. It's like, I still have and lots of years. Pumpkin wants. Pumpkin okay, wants boo -boo. to explore. She sees these lights are a little hard sometimes for the cats. Yeah. So beautiful and, coloring. You know, I love um, you. A neutered ten-year-old male, so senior, uh, senior for senior, or Aww. and free for the month of November. Um, gets along with other cats that's and is actually living in our our, our cat condo. Yep. Yeah, so the communal. Okay. So that's a really good sign that they get this along with other cats. This is a great cat. This wonderful. Yes. He's just so and active. Free, which also includes still our vaccinations free. and our microchips. So it's not like we're leaving anything out. Um, she's and you're doing everything. such a wonderful thing with ten years old. There's mm -hmm. so many, so many uh, people who adopt the older animals here. He certainly doesn't look ten uh, or act it. Yeah, yeah. yeah he's, he's just in good, uh, so. good shape. So he is nice very, very tabby. active, very active. So. And I don't know, I mean, I feel like orange tabbies have such great personalities. They do. Yeah. Actually, tabbies are just wonderful. General, I've had yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, they are. They're At talkative, they're active. He's just super interested in what's going a, on. You yeah, are just like such a, a boy. I just want to see the whole room. Yeah. 
Who are um, all you people? I want to say hi to all of you. Yeah, so he'll, he'll so. need to explore your house yeah. when he first gets there, but then Cute I'm sure he will enjoy sitting on your lap and yeah. cuddling with you. You were um, very good. Good. You were kidding. very good, as much yes. as you wanted to explore the room. Yeah. So. Um, okay, so A number for pumpkin again is 366655. So exciting things happening at the Pasadena Humane Society this month. The entire month of November, um, that's the whole entire month, um, we are having free adoptions for our senior pets. Um, and we say seniors are five years and older, so a lot of the younger senior pets are probably still going to have lots of activity and they're going to be active for um, a long time. So five years and older, that's all of our animals, dogs, cats, rabbits. Um, we still have the standard screenings that apply and the um, must be at least 18 years old to adopt here. Um, but they, and they're still gonna receive everything. So we're not leaving anything out on the adoptions. We, um, we're still giving them their first sets of vaccinations. They're gonna be microchipped and spayed and neutered. Um, and you won't have to pay for those. We're waiving all of those fees for November. Um, and some of the benefits from having a senior pet include a lot of the personality of a senior pet is already set. So you really know what you're getting when you meet a senior pet. Their, their personality is developed and they are who they are, um, which is great because there's no, sometimes with a younger puppy, they're still developing and they're still, they're still developing their personality. Um, the other thing is that a lot of times they're house trained, both cats and dogs. Um, the cats will be litter box trained and the dogs will know how to, um, that they're supposed to potty outside or they'll, they'll be house trained. And even if they're not house trained or even if they, they still need to learn their basic obedience commands, they can, um, the old adage, an old dog can't learn new tricks is totally false. They can, they can learn new tricks and a lot of times their attention span is less. A puppy's attention span is about nine seconds and that's not the case for an older, um, for an older pet. So yeah, they can learn actually probably much better than some of the puppies can because they're more relaxed. Their temperament can be more relaxed. Um, Speaking of laid back and relaxed, that's another benefit of having a senior pet is that they are more, um, just more docile and more relaxed um, a lot of times. Granted, a five-year-old senior might have a little bit more activity than a 12-year-old senior pet. So it's just important to come in and, and meet your perfect match. And just to repeat something, because it's so great, uh, in November, it's free. Five years and older is free. Um, there are so many wonderful older pets and a lot of times they're the hardest ones to get adopted um, because there is some preconceived notions but we at the Pasadena Humane Society think that our older pets here are phenomenal uh, adoption candidates and I know if you come in you'll find one that you'll, you'll love and it'll be a great addition to your home. So come in in November and get a free senior pet. All right, so um, Georgie, lots of sixes in the name or in the number. A three six 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 six. Shoo! Uh, another ten-year-old male. Uh, so, and it looks like another so. nice, healthy ten-year-old male. Oh, um, very so, different than the last uh, cat. <laughs> another this one free plop. adoption. Uh, chocolate point Siamese. Beautiful. Yeah. Now the so tabby. The tabby was very active. I find Siamese very affectionate and. Um, I don't want to use the, it's, our cat's part Chin, oh, Chinese, <laughs> part Siamese, so affectionate, yeah. loves to be close to me, uh -huh. and, um, so it depends on what you like, yeah, you know, absolutely. Um, I love the, uh, the talkative tabbies, and mm -hmm. I love the cuddly Siamese, yep. and, so very mellow and laid back, as you can see, and you the, are. Um, we should have had them on together because they both live in the communal. Oh. So they both get along with other cats, which is really great um, if you have another cat at home. Mm -hmm. um, and Georgie came in as a stray. Really? Um, uh oh. This is a nose hand. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Oh, what's that? What did you see? Such pretty eyes. I, I love the Siamese beautiful. eyes. Just the deep blue. Yeah. Deep blue. yeah. I bet he well, looks really good in the communal. Yeah. So if you're looking for a, a nice, calm lab cat, mm -hmm. this is nice. And for the bargain, bargain price of zero. Free. Mm -hmm. Free. How um, old is this cat? Ten years old. 
And wow. he's neutered already, so oh. he can go home right away. So right well, away. I have a little story. Uh -huh. I was in the supermarket the other day, and I recognized the woman, and I couldn't remember her name, but I walked up to her and I said, Mocha. She adopted Mocha five years ago, and Mocha was either eight or nine, and Mocha's now 14. She said Yay. she has never, she's had animals all her life and never had one as special as Mocha. So uh, it was it was a nice story. Mm -hmm. So ten years old, my I, 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 my years. nephews adopted a cat ten years old, and it lived till twenty seven. So mm -hmm. yeah, um, I can certainly when they're yeah. indoors, they can live a lot longer. They're just not as um, apt to right. catch things when they're inside your. Oh, absolutely! It was an indoor cat. Yeah, yeah, and so yeah. It, so is so is Mocha. Yeah, so they're doing really Hi. well. So this is free. Yes, and um, and the senior cat yeah it, it all works yes so. so Georgie's a number again is a three six 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 our next cat is meow meow I want to say it in like that meow meow voice and I just did uh, a number is three six six three four four an unaltered four-year-old female um, we call this a diluted calico tabby so you can see there's some tabby in there, but there's also some calico in there. Nice. And diluted, because it looks yeah. like it's just a oh. mix of both. Very pretty. And this was an owner turn-in. Owner turn-in, yeah. the owners were moving. You know what, I'm so grateful though, they, you know, if you can't take your pets with you, uh, sometimes they're unfortunately just left behind mm -hmm. in and whatever. Abandoned, yep. Abandoned, and how, how wonderful that this cat was brought in here mm -hmm. and is now warm and safe and you yeah know, and what's really good about the owner turn-ins too is that we have that information from the owner mm -hmm. so yes, yes. Um, this owner said that she's really good mm -hmm. with children cats and dogs so oh. it's good that we have that information to, yes, to give yes. to the new adopter absolutely um, so she's very curious although she's yeah. she, she just wants to be nice and relaxed today, maybe yeah. you know a new home would be very special. Yeah, yeah, yeah she's, so, she's um, um, a perfect lap cat. She is. Yeah, she she's is. just being so nice and so, looking around. Um, I, I love her coloring. I just I think yeah. it's so unique. Could keep Loves to be petted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and she, it does not qualify her for our seniors, for seniors, but no. still, great deal, $70 oh, for the I adoption fee. Can I over so we can get your little face on camera? There How's that? There you go. Aww. Probably a little scared too. Yeah, just you know, a little. All the different personalities mm -hmm. of the pets. So, so yeah. soft and so wonderful. And for only four years old, she yeah. seems very docile and nice and calm. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, we adopted a, a cat at uh, four years old, and it was a wonderful, wonderful experience mm -hmm. for for as long as we had her, and we had her a long time. Yeah. So. And even at four, you know, their personalities are are pretty developed. Yeah. Like this is probably how she's going to be with some like yeah. perky moments I'm yeah. sure because she's still young but um oh yeah she'd be a nice <laughs> lap cat she would yeah. so if you want to snuggle down for our fall weather mm -hmm. here and uh, this is the perfect yeah. cat yeah they're uh, all perfect actually yeah. and you know her name is meow meow, meow so meow. how fitting um and her, her A number again is 366344, and she's an unaltered four-year-old female, so she'll have to get spayed. Um, but so that day, only takes have to wait a day. A day, yeah. yep. And then she can go home. Okay. All right. We have a shelter wish list. So one of the ways you can help us here uh, care for the animals uh, is by donating needed items and on our website there is a wish list but just to give you a few of the things uh, that you can donate you press the donate tab on our website uh, and for cats wet cat and kitten food small cat scratchers durable washable cats and kitten toys and fleece or microfiber cat beds and for dogs bio biodegradable poop bags durable puppy dog toys, and no tennis balls, please. And fleece or microfiber blankets, uh, gently used or okay, that would be okay. And front clipping harnesses, and four to six uh, foot leashes, and that, that, that would just be so helpful. And uh, we, it, it's better if it's not open, but if it is, we'll take a look at it, and hopefully that we'll 
So you could just bring your donated items to the front office during business hours and no appointment is necessary. And if you want to check out our full wish list, it would be PasadenaHumane.org slash um, wish list. So we thank you for your donations. And one nice thing I might remember we, or might mention is we have just a, a fantastic um, store here. And so you could do a double-double, like you could shop in the store and have lots of fun and then donate. So, and that would, that would also be great too. So that is our wish list. And again, PasadenaHumane.org and a slash wish list. Okay, and thank you in advance uh, for all of you who donate. Okay, here comes our first pet. Hi, Bubba. And this is Panda. And Panda's number is A367350. Aren't you cute? Unaltered two-year-old male. Black and white pit bull, cutest. Or I love the faces on the pit bulls. They're so yes. cute. Well, and knows a few like commands. You want to show us the command? Oh boy! How do about you need a tweet? sniff the flower? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I saw him do a sit it's, earlier. Uh, Panda and he loves treats. So let's see how he does. Sit. Sit. Oh, that's yes. Yeah, oh, he's very that's good. So good. He's very good. He can hold he's, it in the boost tail. He's tailwind. very sweet. Very good. Good he boy. He loves attention. He's a good boy. Look at this. Are you getting enough attention here? Are we giving you enough attention? Huh? Doesn't he have the cutest little white socks? Oh yeah. Yes, oh, yeah. you do. Okay, you're and supposed came, to look at the. He came in as a stray, so he has it's a right. story to tell. Oh, so he he okay. can tell he can tell you some really good stories and what it's like to finally be here where it's nice and warm mm -hmm. and you're fed and people love you, huh? You just want somebody to love you. How old so is Panda? He is um, two years happy. old. Two Ooh. years old. Turn around. Let's see your little face this here. Is, is this on. your best side? This is, is that he thinks he. You know, whenever it says here what what it it like loves attention, uh -huh. <laughs> loves treats. Come on. Let's Show see your little if we face. can't get you turned around. And a panda's adoption fee would be a hundred and twenty-five dollars, which <laughs> look at see? that. So. You can do it. Oh, that's yeah. good. Okay. Yeah, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. So he's, a, you yeah. know, the pit bulls, they love to please their owners. And um, and I bet owners, that's we love boy. to please our pets, mm -hmm. don't we? Don't we? It's, it's like, like, I saw where those yeah. treats were coming from. Yeah. Coming so this from is two years old, so he's still kind of a puppy-like. <laughs> and um, this, would you please I turn know. around? Show your beautiful face. Oh, that's yeah. a good boy. How are we going to eat that? have people see how cute That's you a are. Boy there. Actually the best way is to come down and meet Panda and then you probably fall in love. We're just just the the energy in the room is so good great boy. with Panda. Good boy. So as I said, a Panda's adoption fee is $125 and I'll give you Panda's number again. Mm -hmm. uh, great dog. To, I always I always look at dogs to exercise, you know, they're just yes, wonderful. Yes. Get you out there. And side and, side note, these are some of the leashes. Oh, um, this okay. one has um, one of our volunteers puts these adopt me uh -huh. stickers on it for when they go to parks. But this so is the kind of leashes. Yeah, that we so really those need. would be nice to donate. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And can we get those in the store too? You can yeah. get these in the store. Great. Yep. All and, right. and these collars as well. Yeah. All right. That would be wonderful. Yeah. Cool. And, uh, okay. So let me give you Panda's number again. It's A367350. So at the Pasadena Humane Society, we have a really nice large behavior and training department, and we have a lot of group classes. Um, we have some new classes that are starting in November. We have an intro to nose work class. Um, unfortunately, it's already filled up, but we will have classes as well in um, in January, starting in January. And the intro to nose work class is canine scent work. So you start off using treats and your dog searches for the treats, and then it moves on to um, other kind of odors like cloves or um, lavender or something like that. So it's a really good thing, uh, especially for senior pets, dogs that can't really do a lot of the active group classes. The canine nose work is a great uh, great opportunity for your senior pets to have a training class. We also have agility classes. So we have all of the agility equipment in our training center and we have agility classes on Sunday and Monday nights. You just have to go onto our website at PasadenaHumane.org to see when the classes are upcoming. We don't have our January schedule up yet, but it should be up in the next couple weeks so you'll know what classes are happening. A really exciting class that we have in December, or starting in November, is a tricks class. So you'll teach things like shake or high five, um, a lot of times a bow, um, 
lots of really, really great fun commands that you can impress all your friends with. And it's just a really nice class because you're, you're, you want to do something from the basic class. So you've taught your dog all the basic commands. You want to get something that's a little bit more, um, still want to do the training, still want to get them around other dogs so they're acclimated and they're socialized. Um, so the tricks class is a great way to, for that to happen. Um, and the other classes that we have are the basic obedience, puppy. We have a puppy social that's on Saturday mornings. That's for dogs that are six months and younger. And it's off-leash play for puppies. Uh, we manage it. We have trainers there. So we teach your dogs and you how your dog should be socializing with other dogs. So we'll go over proper play behaviors. That way when you are, you're out somewhere and your dog is playing off leash with another dog, you'll know what to look for. Um, that's a really good class on Saturday mornings. That's from 9.30 to 10.30 and the cost is $10 for the general public or $8 if you're a current student. So just check out our website under training and you can see all of our current classes that are upcoming and um, hopefully you'll sign up and we will see you in class. Again, our website is PasadenaHumane.org. Thanks and we'll see you in class. So let's See our last dog here. This is Shiloh, and Hello, Shiloh's Shiloh. number is A364474. Thanks, Jamie. Mm -hmm. Ten-year-old like male. Oh you work the tweets, do you? Ten-year-old, you know what that means. Well, yeah. Completely free this completely month. Completely free, free for seniors. Yes. Um, so th this is like just this? great. Not even oh. Normally we charge $20 no, like for the microchip. Uh, but we do have a grant, and this this little guy, not only let's let's see, he's black and tan chihuahua. Mm -hmm. You never did grow into your ears, did you? No. <laughs> so, boy, I bet you are so cute. Can be a little shy at first, and uh, but once yeah, up right quickly. Yeah, they're right That's are. nice. He's been out in the mobile. I bet he made lots of friends. Mm -hmm. So it's just so cute. And came in as a stray. Can you imagine a little stray? Oh, look at this. Like I was you know, I noticed he has a pink collar, which mm -hmm. reminds me that um, Glendale police officer Tim Feely and retired canine beauty uh, were helping take not only a bite out of crime, but a bite out of cancer with the Army of Pink campaign. Nice. And they did a fantastic job. So we, we thank um, Officer Tim Feely and former canine Yudi, who has been on our show. Yudi has been on our yeah, show. Yeah, a couple months ago. So Yudi's still out there doing good things for people, uh, for cancer awareness. So congratulations to both of you for, um, actually they won the Army of Pink campaign. Oh, so, great. So I thought of the, that with the pink collar on there. Mm -hmm. So that's great. So again, this is Shiloh. Yep, and, and you should see um, the coloring in the back. He's it's just like a well, got little see if spots. you could turn him around. You want just to turn him around? Oh, look at you. A little you. bit. Look at here. You're also helping, you know, Shiloh's 10 that. years old and it'd be nice in the twilight years to, to give a dog a home. You yeah. know, it's, it's just a wonderful, yeah. wonderful and feeling. Smaller dogs mm -hmm. do live longer than larger dogs. Mm -hmm. So, um, I mean, for Shiloh being 10, he's probably yeah. still got a handful of years, maybe yeah. even more left. Yeah, we have, we have one person here who would come in and, and seek um, someone older, a, yeah, a, a, yeah. an older pet. Well, you do know. Yeah who adopted a 10-year-old. I do. Mm -hmm. I do. Just recently. Carol Ann did. I did, yes. And, and I know she's got a lot of spunk in her yeah. still. And so She was a wonderful dog. She was on the show. She was on the show, show yeah. Said. So maybe maybe you can send a picture and we can yeah, see Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And put yep, a picture. She's doing really, she's loving life at, at our house. So. And isn't that a feel good? Mm -hmm. That yeah. is such and a And it's just good. so nice because she's, she's nice and mellow and she's already got all her uh, we can leave her alone during, you know, when we go and she's mm -hmm. just like, see you later, it's fine. Uh -huh. And, you know, she just, I really knew what I was getting into when I adopted her because she, um, she was older and her personality was set and she's just a, she's a lovely, lovely Lucy, we call her. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. That, that's a great story. Yeah. That's a great story. Oh, you like so the next So if you haven't oh, seen uh, an animal on our show today, uh, definitely the best way to do it is uh, just come down and see them but you walk in and they're, they're bound to lock eyes with you so but we can be reached at 626-792-7151 we um, are on our website as we've mentioned several times today is pasadenahumane.org but the very best way to come and see us is 361 south raymond avenue from glendale you take the 
210 freeway. It's kind of hard to see that sign. It says Del Mar exit. It's a way over to the right, but it's kind of faded. So you take the Del Mar exit, you take a left on Del Mar and a right on to Raymond, and our parking lot is right there. And uh, again, our phone number is 626-792-7151, and we would just love to see you here and uh, lock eyes. And, Hello. Uh, but most, well, I want to thank all our volunteers. Oh, and we're yes. all, I forgot, we're all over social media, thanks to our producer, yes. Zara. Yes. And uh, you said, give us likes. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> on Facebook. And what else can we tell everyone? Yeah. So, what, what's Shiloh's so. number again? Oh, Shiloh. Shiloh, Shiloh, Shiloh. He's oh, sitting, I thought she she, she's sitting here so nice and calm. Shiloh's number is A364474. Sorry about that, Shiloh. So again, thank you for helping us help the animals, and we will see you next time.